In this video, I will go over 8 ways that you can use to clean your lungs. Hi, I am Dr. I. Welcome to A Healthy Dose. Let's become healthier together. Our lungs do a lot for us. Therefore, it's good to take steps to help them work better. The air we breathe in can be contaminated with many kinds of pollutants. Everything from pollen to chemicals to secondhand smoke can be trapped in the air and enter our lungs. Our lungs are mostly self-cleaning organs, but there are certain things we can do to help them function at an optimal level. A lung cleanse may be helpful for individuals who have a health condition that causes breathing difficulties such as asthma, COPD, or cystic fibrosis. You may also benefit from a lung cleanse if you are a heavy smoker or have to use certain inhaled medications. The first way we can cleanse our lungs is by getting an air purifier. We can start cleansing our lungs by improving the quality of the air in our home. We can purchase an air purifier that can be placed in individual rooms. The second way that we can clean our lungs is by changing our house filters. Along with getting an air purifier, we should change all of the filters in our home and clear the vents such as those in the bathroom or our air conditioning or heating vents. It's also important to replace our furnace filters every six months too. The third way that we can cleanse our lungs is by eliminating artificial scents. You may think that you are are helping the air in your home by making it smell nice with air fresheners, candles, or those popular wax candle warmers. However, these fragrances are full of harmful chemicals that can irritate your lungs. Even household cleaners can act as irritants, so check your cupboards and replace your cleaners with all natural products if possible. The fourth way to clean our lungs is by spending more time outside. Getting plenty of fresh air can help expand the tissue issues in our lungs and keep them working properly. It's good to check the pollution forecasts in your area. Avoid exercising outside when pollution numbers are high and stay away from burning trash, burning wood, or other types of smoke. If you are concerned about pollution or you live in an area with heavy pollutants, you can wear an air filter mask. The fifth way of cleaning our lungs is by trying breathing exercises. Certain breathing exercises can improve lung function, especially for individuals who currently smoke, who have smoked in the past, or who have lung damage from chronic lung disease. There are also tools that can help you practice your breathing, such as a spirometer. This kind of device is often used after surgery to help with recovery process. Other breathing exercises don't require the use of assistive devices. These techniques include pursed lip breathing, belly breathing, which is also known known as diaphragmatic breathing. The sixth way that you can clean your lungs is by practicing percussion. Percussion or chest percussion is a technique that can help drain fluid from the lungs. It involves having you lie down with your head lowered and tapping lightly on your back, working from top to bottom. It's often combined with postural drainage, a technique where you change your body's position so that it's easier for fluid to move out of the lungs. You may be on your side, stomach, or back. The seventh way that you can clean your lungs is by changing your diet. Your diet can affect your lung health in a variety of ways. Eating vitamin D-rich foods may improve your lung health. A 2017 study of people with asthma found that healthy levels of vitamin D reduced the number of asthma attacks that required corticosteroid treatment. The best food sources of vitamin D are usually animal products such as salmon, sardines, and eggs. Anti-inflammatory foods and drinks contain antioxidants that reduce airway inflammation and can help you breathe easier. You can try green tea. In a Korean study, consuming green tea just twice a day was shown to reduce the risk of COPD in people 40 years old and older. Other anti-inflammatory options include berries, broccoli, turmeric, and dark 
chocolate. You can also choose a diet that's lower in carbohydrates and higher in healthy fats. Metabolizing carbohydrates produces more carbon dioxide and uses more oxygen than metabolizing fats. The eighth way of cleansing our lungs is by getting more aerobic exercise. An exercise routine that incorporates aerobic activity can help improve your lung capacity. Aerobic exercises include walking, running, cycling, whether outdoors or indoors, swimming, boxing, sports such as tennis. If you have a chronic lung disease, it's important to speak with your doctor before starting an exercise program to find the routine that's right for you. So in conclusion, for better lung health, you will want to start with prevention and make healthy choices. For example, quitting smoking, getting regular exercise that is appropriate for your fitness level, and eating a nutritious diet will help your lungs. You should also speak to your doctor about other steps you can take to improve your lung health. Thank you for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe. Watch more videos by clicking on the video here.